everybody and welcome to the channel. Have you ever thought about this? Now it's my understanding that they're called shishi odoshi or Japanese deer scarers and you see them in Japanese gardens but they're a fascinating mechanism and when I looked at it I thought Hmm, we should be able to use that and take that swinging pendulum motion and turn it into rotation so we could drive something with it, like maybe a clock, a generator, a toy, I don't know what, but I'm fascinated by that rocking backwards and forwards motion and what we could possibly do with it. And what I came up with was this. Now there are surprisingly few parts for it, but the heart of it is this thing, which sits on a little riser there, so it's kept out of the way. So we have that arc, and then we have this piece of bamboo, and that's going to go on pivot points. The water dribbles down there, fills that, makes it do that. Automatically the water then goes there, and it will rock backwards and forwards, or at least that's the idea. All I need to do, obviously, is put some bearings on it and a couple of pivot points. Like that. Now, obviously, this can swing all the way around, which we don't want it to do. We want it to stop there. So there's a couple of brackets that go either side in there, and there's the other one that goes there, so that it will only do that. So we need to glue those down. Now it can only do that. And now you need a water feed, which is what this bit and this bit is for. That goes on there like that, and then the collecting horn goes on there, and that will direct the water into the right position. <laughs> so now we can test this and see if it works. <laughs> okay, we need some way of getting that power out and we're going to use this, a large cog right there on the swivel which will be a driving cog. Now with a simple addition of this cog we have a point at which when that rocks backwards and forwards we can take power out from here to run, well, loads of things. Now I don't know if you remember this. This is the Seiko winding device and what it was was anywhere you turned this backwards or forwards it converted the motion to the motion only went in one direction. There are other ways of doing this but this is a very neat way and very simple way so if we make a few modifications to this we can attach it to this and turn our rocking motion into a continuous one-way motion which we can then gear up. Now we need a few minor modifications so instead of having this plate with two projections on it, we've got a plate with one projection and then we can put a little pin behind there like that. And then we can put our rocker onto that pin so that it fits on like that. And then that won't fly off. Then obviously we can put our handle onto here like that. And then our ratchet device, you might notice I've put an extra step on it there and that's to take another output cog and that will drive this output cog in one direction. So let's fit all that together. And that's it completed. Now let's give it a test and see. Granted, it's a little bit nutty, but what's not to love about something that's Heath Robinson? And what are the advantages of something as daft as this? Well, well, for one thing, that water's not falling very high, nor is it falling very fast. And so for a, a water source where you don't have a great drop or don't have a great deal of water, then it's a possibility for scavenging energy out of it. Now that rocking backwards and forwards is translated through this um, watch mechanism into a continuous rotation. Okay, that rotation isn't very fast, Fast, but of course we can gear that up to get a much faster rotation and that would mean playing around with these buckets a little bit to maybe have more water so we get more weight forcing that round getting a faster turn but that's the general principle of 
my mechanism for scavenging energy from water that you wouldn't have a lot of water and it wouldn't have a great flow. Personally, <laughs> it's awesome, if a little cracked. <laughs> these spirals on the Thingiverse should anybody want to play with it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching and please do remember to like and subscribe.